Hi everyone, welcome to Ray Energy Tech YouTube channel. The purpose of this video is to make sure that every home can will be able to afford an off-grid electricity by buying them and doing it yourself. So it is called do it yourself, and the purpose of today's video is to show you how you can connect your inverter to the changeover switch and as you can see here the inverter has been connected already we need just this screwdriver to do the job and uh, we need this 1.5 mm cable to connect the inverter to the changeover switch so as you can see here the inverter has been connected positive to positive and the negative to negative just I, just as i have always said you have to make sure that your polarities are correct and this is a 1000 watt inverter as you can see here 1000 watt inverter a 12 volt 1000 watt inverter and this is also a 12 volt battery a 12 volt 100 amps battery so yeah so it is important you understand how your changeover switch works okay so this is the cable here the cable here supplies the house the cable here supplies the house and this is uh, the cable of the electricity distribution company that supplies your house here in nigeria we call it nepa cable so this is the electricity distribution cable and uh, here we are going to be putting our inverter so here here we have here on the changeover switch we have what is called positive and negative and um, we are going to be using this A as positive and this B you can see here as negative. So this is the cable of the electricity distribution company and you can see that positive is coming to A and the negative is coming to B. So the same thing is applicable to the cable that supplies the house. Here we have the positive cable and here we have the negative cable and here at the bottom of the changeover switch we are also going to have our positive cable for the inverter here and our negative cable for the inverter here and uh, we are going to be using this cable for this video so let's pick it up and uh, connect it's appropriately here there is here there is a o just as you can see here so the negative cable will come to this b side and uh, the positive cable will come to this a side so let me do that now so i have been able to connect the inverter plug cable with the changeover switch this is it and uh, one thing you should also understand by the time you are connecting the plug is um, the positive and negative terminal of the plug so you can see the l the cable the red cable will go to the l and the um n the negative cable will go to the n by the time you lose this plug trying to fix it so that is all so the next thing to do now is just to plug our um changeover switch plug here to the inverter okay that is done and now to turn on our inverter which we supply the house you can see now the inverter has been turned on now now 
this is inverter once i bring this down the light will be supplied in the house so let me bring it down now okay so light has been supplied into the house and uh, if i take it up this is for nepa presently there is no light that is why you can see that uh there is no light on the um electricity distribution company um side so here is the inverter now you can see light so the in the house now we have our tv on we have our fan working and uh, every other room in the apartment is also supplied with light and all other um, wall sockets in the house have been supplied with light so very quickly let me show you this cable that i showed you the other time this is the nepa cable that i was talking about the other time and then uh, what it means is that this cable is coming from the outside of the building you can see it's been attached being drawn down to the house over there so that is what i mean by that so everything is working appropriately now as you can see okay so that is that is just it thank you for watching if you find this video useful please subscribe to our youtube channel thank you